something nasty happens online, what should you do? For these children at a Kent primary school, the internet is a key part of their lives. But now they're learning about its dangers. And the organisation which runs classes like this found worrying news for parents when they asked over a thousand children about their web habits. The survey of 9 to 11 year olds found that 18% had met someone in the real world they'd only previously met online. 22% said they'd been on the internet after 9pm on a school night and 12% had missed school after a late night online. Youngsters actually participate in a lot of risky behaviours that actually I don't believe the parents know about. Not because of any um, ill will on behalf of the parents, it's just the parents don't understand technology. What this research shows, and this class bears it out, is that many primary school children are now really experienced users of the internet. But what they don't know is that many sites, like Facebook for example, are inappropriate for their age. And they seem pretty unaware of the dangers online. But the safety lessons are getting through to some of these children. You need to look out for who's on the other side and whether you know them or not and whether they're safe. Not to talk to people who you don't know. I would just talk to people that I know, like friends from school or people from old schools that I know. But the key message from this survey is for parents. If you want to keep your children safe, you have to understand what they're doing on the internet. Rory Catherine-Jones, BBC News.